Local wedding planners say many people who are looking to get married are now planning smaller, more intimate weddings. They say this is mostly as a result of record high inflation. 10 News reporter Fernando Garcia Francescini joins us in the studio to share more on what the wedding market looks like now. Hey, Fernando. Hi, Katie. Wedding planners I spoke to say they've had to increase prices on their services, particularly because gas and food now cost more. And they say that makes their task of creating the perfect wedding a little more complicated. A case of chicken before COVID was $50. Now it's $150. So we've had to put our prices up. For sure, prices have increased for packages if a bride wants them, but really it's within that transportation cost. So someone who gives me like a $20,000 budget, it now might cost like 40,000. Planning a wedding is getting much more expensive. That's why wedding planner Mara Lamb says she's noticed many of her clients are now going for smaller weddings. So like someone having a 500 guest count, they might have like a 100 person guest count or like a 50 person. She says inflation has forced her to get more creative and stay up to date with the market to ensure she can still make people's dream wedding happen. Lamb says though she believes smaller weddings is a trend that might be here to stay. They have enjoyed that just because it's cost a little bit less um, from a catering and like your design perspective and they are able to interact with all of their guests. And Katie Lamb tells me that because of inflation and shortages, she is recommending people who are looking to get married to give themselves ample time to plan that wedding and also to be flexible with budgeting as well. Oh yeah, flexibility is key right key. now, Fernando. Thank you so much.